I also forgot to mention that I'm going to be posting two pictures of two different readings that I took, and that's going to be from a friend of mine. He bought the Harbor Freight. I want to say it's called Atlas. Um, that one, I think, was $129. Um, that one is cheaper, obviously, and the flow rate is uh, pretty much the same as far as miles per hour goes. So this is a new toy that I got today. Um, it is a uh, variable uh, trigger. You can barely press it and then it's gonna do it low and then squeeze it or whatever faster. And up top here is a turbo button, so barely pressing it. See the motor there? And then... Turbo. It also comes with a battery uh, indicator on the battery. That's kind of cool. Uh, this thing is on sale right now at Walmart for $177. Uh, I did do a test on it already. Um, these things are rated to be at, what'd you say? It was like 125, uh, 125 miles an hour. Uh, I went and did my testing and it actually is, well, I'll show you. It's gonna be a little hard because I don't have my GoPro again. So um, I'm gonna show you what it looks like after I've already put the blower on there. So essentially what I'm doing is I'm putting the meter in front of the wind speed. That's not really a very strong test, but it gives you a basic idea of what, how much air it's moving out, or not CFM, but how many miles per hour the wind is moving at. We'll see if it works like this. .1 miles per hour. Now we're going to bump it up to the turbo mode. And that increased it to 67 miles per hour. So these guys work decent. Uh, it's not going to hit your 125 miles an hour like it states on the box, even on turbo mode. This little guy right here, I tested earlier and that plugs into the wall and it's got a narrow uh, opening that guy hits uh, 88 miles per hour, but it has smaller opening this guy You can see all the way down inside in the little fan this guy if you were to get a nice little uh, Nozzle that would kind of taper in you could increase the pressure just like a pressure washer would do the narrow the uh, fin or the fan the higher the PSI so uh, For it being hundred and seventy seven dollars It's pretty lightweight um, it's not very heavy. I, I haven't tested out the, what do you want to call it? Uh, the battery life yet. Um, but pretty much I just wanted to show you based on if you were looking at this guy, like I was, I saw 125 miles an hour. Uh, I saw 550 CFM. Yeah, 550 CFM. And I said, oh man, that's probably going to be a really good, uh, blower. But even with it being at around 70 miles an hour, it's still decent. Um, it'll still move leaves around. You can still clean your yard. Um, I'm going to use it to dry my car when I wash it. So that's pretty much what I'm going to use it for. And then also to clean up the floor in the garage uh, whenever I cut my grass and stuff like that. But anyways, I just wanted to show a quick video on the Walmart Heart. Uh, this one's the 40 volt. They sell a 20 volt. That's much cheaper. This one is the 40. So it's the highest one they got. And that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching.